Hello, my name is Dr. Carlo Oyer. I am an emergency physician and in this patient education video I'm going to talk to you about the acute abdomen. What is an acute abdomen? Well, doctors use the term acute abdomen to describe an episode of belly pain that starts suddenly and lasts for a few hours or maybe longer. Doctors use the word acute when something starts suddenly. The abdomen or belly is the part of the body between the chest and the genital area. When people have an acute abdomen, their pain is so severe, they have a hard time moving or breathing. It makes them want to go to the hospital, see the doctor right away. A true acute abdomen is a medical emergency. The pain symptoms are different for different people. The pain can feel sharp or crampy. People can feel the pain all over their belly or only in one part. Some people feel better if they curl into a ball while others need to lie flat and completely still. People often feel sick to their stomach and retch or even vomit. Of course, not everyone with pain in the belly has an acute abdomen. When pain is less severe, it can be due to something like a virus or a stomach inflammation called gastritis. What causes an acute abdomen? An acute abdomen can have different causes. Most of the time, an acute abdomen happens when there's a serious problem with one or more organs inside the abdomen. Organs in the abdomen can be part of the digestive, urinary, or female reproductive systems. Conditions that affect organs in the chest or in the genital area can also cause acute abdomen. In other words, it can radiate up and down, even though these organs aren't actually in the belly. People might still have pain in their belly. This is called referred pain. Common causes of an acute abdomen include the following. Appendicitis. Appendicitis is the term for when the appendix, a long, thin pouch that hangs down from the large intestine, gets inflamed or even infected. Diverticulitis. Diverticulitis is an infection that develops in small pouches that can form in the intestine this is more common in older people. Gallstones. Gallstones are small stones that form inside the organ called the gall bladder, which stores bile, a fluid that helps the body break down fat in digestion. Abscesses. An abscess is a collection of pus in the intestine. A bowel perforation. That is a hole in the bowel wall and that can be truly life-threatening. A perforated ulcer, this is a hole in the wall of the stomach or even the intestine. Pancreatitis, this is a term for when the pancreas gets inflamed. A rupture cysts in the ovary, cysts in the ovary are fluid filled sacs that can form in some women. They sometimes rupture which means that they break open and spill out. An ectopic pregnancy. An ectopic pregnancy is a pregnancy that develops outside the uterus. When should you see a doctor or nurse? If you have symptoms of acute abdomen, see your doctor or nurse or go to the hospital, the emergency department, right away. If you have a true acute abdomen, it is important that treatment begin without delay. Will you need tests? Most likely. The doctor or nurse will ask about your symptoms, including where the pain is, what it feels like. He or she will ask you about your current and past medical conditions and do a physical exam. Your doctor might do repeat exams over time to follow your symptoms and progress. Your doctor will then decide which tests should you have based on your symptoms and your individual situation. Tests might include the following. Blood tests, urine tests, x-rays, an ultrasound, or a CT scan, or any other imaging of the abdomen. How is an acute abdomen treated? Treatment depends on what's the cause of the pain. It might include one or more of the following. Fluids given via IV, pain medications, antibiotic medicines to treat infection, and other medicines to treat other medical conditions and surgery if this is a surgical disease. I hope you learned a lot in this video. 
And for other medical education videos like this one, go to patienteducation.video. Thank you for watching.